Hello everyone, this is episode number 7 of my Zelda Solaris DX video guide. Um, we have finished the dungeon of Master Arbor. We have the, um, the hookshot. There are not, uh, f not that much um, s side quests, you know, that you can do with it. Except maybe here. Let's go down to this cave and find this chest. 100 rupees. Fantastic. But that's everything we can do because we cannot access the other side here. I have um, 300 rupees, it's the maximum, so maybe I will spend some money, buy some food, <laughs> oh, I want those hearts. Okay, you have to go anyway to the bakery and buy this, an apple pie. I already have it because um, I bought it in a previous, in an earlier episode. But if you don't have it, just buy it. It costs um, 35 rupees. Uh, what else can we do? Nothing. Oh, yes! There is something we can do. You're not exactly supposed to do it now, but it's fun. You know, there is a piece of heart there. Normally, no, you cannot access it for now. But there is a trick. It has nothing to do with this, mon this monster, but just go near the hole, shoot your boomerang, and move to the right. Oh, I failed, but normally it should work. Yes, you found a piece of heart. Two more and you'll have another heart. So actually, we could have done that in an, an earlier episode. As soon as you have the, um, the burn ring, you can do it. Okay, and uh, if you don't know what to do, go to the telepathic booth. I'm not going there because it's in the other side of the world. And I'm already where I'm supposed to go, so let's go. Oh! I wanted to spend some money, it's too late. Never mind. I will keep this chest for later because it has some money in it. If you give me something to eat, I'll let you go. I'll let you on the other side of this wall. Okay. Give me that apple pie. Super. I eat the pie in appreciation. Some people believe there is a treasure beyond this wall, but I've never found any. Wall of surprises. And. It's a um, mini game, like the one in the Zelda Link's Awakening. You have to read the very first sign, so this one, which tells you to go to the right. So go to the exact right of the first sign, up, left, and so on. Okay. So left is exactly this guy up 
and he, I know it's a very stupid puzzle. Left, up. Very stupid because very long. <laughs> right. Plus there is some grass that is slowing you down. Up. Right. And here is a hint. I mean, a trick to go faster because we have already read this sign. Down. Right. Up. It's very long. But I know this game has very stupid puzzles or stupid mazes. Right. Up. Left. Up. Right. And if you read the wrong sign, you have to start over and do everything again. Left. Down. Left. Up. Right. Down. Right. It's almost finished. Up. Right. Ta-da! Ooh! Finally! You found some gold bars. They shimmer shimmer and are very valuable. Let's get out of here. With our, our gold. There is something here. There's a shop, actually. Um, I need to spend some money. Welcome to the lake shop. Our items are the cheapest in the area. I don't care, actually. Uh, let's take some bombs. 50 rupees. And let's use them here. See this? Woo! Piece of heart! There is a lot of pieces of heart in this game. Billy the Reckless is caven. Entry forbidden. So let's go. <laughs> um, don't take that pot. You will see why. Um, so you have to use the hookshot like I just did to get there. But you cannot open it for now. Hello, you. I hope you come with something worth. Something worth doing, if you dare enter my cavern. I am Billy the Reckless, the greatest adventurer of all time. No, that's me. During my expedition to Mount Terror, I brought back a priceless treasure. Even Princess Zelda would not have been able to find it. It's an extremely rare plant. I am the only living soul to have one in his possession. I cleared all the obstacles of Montero, faced every danger, and walked away unscathed. It is hero heroically, oh, it's hard to say for me, so that I found this flower of extreme value an Edelweiss. Edelweiss. Okay, give it to me. Don't expect me to give you my, my, my Edelweiss for free. I confronted the dangers of Montero. Okay, no, you already said to find it. If you don't have anything of value to give me, then run along. 
what will you give me? Um, you can try to give him an apple pie, a croissant, or anything, but the only thing he wants, of course, is your gold. What? You have gold bars? Hmm. Hmm. Deal! Here, take your stupid flower. You found an Edelweiss. This pretty flower from High Road's Mountains is extremely rare. And he goes away. We won't see him for a while. So we have the flower. Let's go back. And here's why you needed the pot. Let's destroy the sign. <laughs> okay, so we can go to to the next dungeon. Maybe I should buy something because I'm too rich. So it's this way, because maybe you remember, there was a sign here, he who will plant a nettlewise at the top of the Beaumont Hill will have a nice day. So let's go. You're planting your edelweiss. Boom! Secret place, secret cave, oh, and dark cave. There is not that much things to do here for now because you cannot get there. But what we we can do is um, is um, going to the next dungeon because it's here, Bowman's Palace. Okay, guys, thank you for watching, and see you next time.